Hello everyone, welcome back to Let's Talk Wild, your girl Tay here, and I'm back with some animal news. This time, Jonathan the Giant Tortoise, he is the oldest living land animal on earth. He celebrated his 190th birthday, I know that's right. So in this video, I'll be discussing his backstory, you know, what he's been doing all these years, what type of tortoise he is, and how he celebrated his birthday. But before we get into that, make sure you guys like and share the video, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to the YouTube channel channel turn on your post notifications okay if you're new welcome if you are returning thank you now let's talk wild jonathan the tortoise just celebrated his 190th birthday on sunday december 4th 2022 he is the oldest known living land animal on earth and the oldest reptile of the turtle turpin and tortoise order ever recorded he has lived through multiple historical events including two world wars and neil armstrong's first steps on the moon he was born in the early 1800s and has lived on the South Atlantic Ocean's remote island, St. Helena, since 1882. When he was brought to St. Helena, he was fully grown and scientists estimated that he was around 50 years old at the time. He was a gift to the governor at the time, Governor William Gray Wilson, and has lived at the governor's house ever since. He spends his time grazing, sunbathing, and chilling with the other giant tortoises that live there. Previously, Jonathan was thought to be an Aldebaran tortoise from the Aldebaran Atoll, which is located in the Indian Ocean and a part of the Republic of Seychelles. But in 1997, the Nature Protection Trust of Seychelles had a worldwide search of public and private collections, and after zoology, and the Seychelles Nature Trust closely examined his shell, they determined Jonathan was the Seychelles Giant Tortoise. The Seychelles Giant Tortoise is originally from the Seychelles Island located in the Indian Ocean. They were hunted and used as a food source by European sailors and scientists thought they were extinct, but they were rediscovered with little over a hundred left in the world. Tourists can visit Jonathan and the other tortoises that reside at the governor's house during their tour day you could take pictures and selfies with him but you cannot touch him okay for more information you can visit the saint helena tours website if you are watching on youtube the link will be in the description and i will have it posted on the let's talk wild instagram account People from around the world shared their love for Jonathan by sharing pictures and videos of him when they visited St. Helena. I love that he's loved by so many people around the world, even by people that haven't even met him. People that have followed his life and journey through social media. It's amazing how this one animal can bring so much love and joy to people. I wish it could be like that with other animals, but that's not the case. However, Jonathan is the perfect candidate and he holds the title of the longest living land animal well okay so this audio was originally recorded for the let's talk wild podcast episode episode 12 where i discussed jonathan but if you guys want to hear my personal wild story about how i got my pet turtle make sure you guys head over to your podcasting platforms and look up let's talk wild and it's the most recent episode episode 12 i discussed jonathan but i also give my wild crazy story about how i got my pet turtle leia so if you guys want to check it out like i said head over to your podcast and platforms and look up let's talk wild so what do you guys think leave a comment i really want to know you guys thoughts on this make sure you follow me on all podcasting and social media platforms at let's talk wild get the video a thumbs up subscribe to the youtube channel all that good stuff now love yourself love one another most importantly, love your pets and the animals. I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.